Look at the size difference. I know, man. You're way taller than me. You're like... <laughs> <laughs> what is going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the Knights of Horror we are here my second time here at Urban Legends uh, drive through haunt this is Rob's first yep, time my first time uh, they've done a lot of changes since we've uh, since we've last seen this I mean it's a little bit more organized as far as parking goes as far as how they're letting everyone in uh, and then I've heard they've added a, a couple more things to for, as far as scare wise go so we're very excited to see what's going on Rob what are you looking forward to the most tonight you know what uh, I've watched some videos I've tried to stay you know away from full-on stuff but I'm just excited to be here the event I could already hear the screaming and all the banging and music going on so that's kind of got me pumped so I'm just I'm excited to be here man he's excited to be here man so we're back urban legends I had a fun time the first time I know a lot of people really been shitting on the event and I wish they wouldn't because it's more of just about having fun but everyone has their own opinions at the end of the day I respect them and uh, I'm just excited to see what they've added like I said parking getting in was already super organized way more organized than when we came opening night and it looks a lot like they've worked on a lot of stuff since opening night so I'm excited to see that join us we're gonna do another full walkthrough and ride through we'll have commentary uh, I know Rob will I think you're filming. I'm yeah, gonna I'm, I'm at my, Rob's gonna my be camera's filming. right in there. I'm going to bring it out a little bit. So there might be a video on Rob's channel as well if you want to see his point of view of things, but check it all out. But here we go. Urban Legends drive through Haunt. All right, guys. I have to say, just going through this again, and it's probably just because it's early in the night, but it's hella organized, like, this time around. Like, they did a really good job of fixing out kinks. I know usually every Haunt opening weekend always has a few kinks to work out, and they really very fastly fixed a lot of kings so i'm excited to go through this uh <laughs> urban legends just gave us permission on instagram to film through the sunroof yeah. so i'm gonna try my best to get a lot of that footage for you guys um because i think that's awesome of them to let me do that uh i will do my best to see what i can get but we're here to have a good time right rob that's right and we're gonna tie down anthony up to the sunroof I'm okay with that, really, for the content. I really am. Content's what's, what's important. Let's see how Robin's doing. How are you doing, Robin? You, you scared? You ready no. To go? Actually, I'm not scared yet. Not scared? Not yet. When I see the lights, probably. When I see the when you when you I mean you're hearing the screen already, so when you see the, when you watch the movie, maybe a little bit more. But uh, all right, guys, we're gonna jump in right now, so I'm excited. Let's do this. documentary here tonight it's so pretty excited beautiful <laughs> good work right here Academy of thank Award worthy. you I appreciate it I appreciate it I worked very hard on it <laughs> Academy Award worthy man well, my my what a tasty looking group we have here <laughs> would you all like to join me for dinner later heck yeah what are we having these tales bring fear in children and adults alike as they are whispered around campfires it makes you feel any better I'm six foot six so. him <laughs> <laughs> the most meat. <laughs> oh, yeah. Just up the canyon. 
these spirits were his car. The to oh yeah, my car. And furious. Yeah, pretty much. I'm not proud of it, but can't we at least put them on the smooth transition or something? Black Star Canyon. During the day, a hike through Black Star Canyon is peaceful and quiet. But once the sun goes down, everything changes. There are tales of nighttime hikers hearing eerie music, tribal drums and conversations in the brush, screams and howls, faint chanting and even unexplained objects in the sky. According to record, Black Star Canyon is the site where a group of trappers searching for their stolen horses in 1831. Hello, how's everyone doing tonight? Good, how are you? Good, are we having a good night? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? I hope so! Oh my god. The Sasquatch. I'm terrified. She was excited. Yo, Sasquatch is... from In-N-Out. <laughs> In-N-Out? Really? Wasn't, did, wasn't she wearing an In-N-Out costume? <laughs> I thought she was from in and out The forests of California. And of course, there's always the fabled tales of Orange County's Carnival Gravesite. Hidden away from the book okay. for many years. Well, I mean, I could be, this could be mine. A seriously burned in an unsolved arson investigation. The abandoned carnival is a tr- Get your foot off the brakes. Can I yell it? The green light. What? The green light. So that means you can turn on your car. Stupid. <laughs> Like I said, there's been some kinks that's been worked out. <laughs>
That guy is like the whole, he makes this whole zone better.
that the first time. Oh my god! Her tent all messed up. <laughs> what happened to her tent? She thinks she's going to get in there. Killed over there. No, I heard it. What was that, Ben? Guys, where's Ben? Ben! Ben! We got it here, final girl. Swamp Thing costume, but... Oh, then they, they actually improved. I wonder if, uh... Oh, there it is right there. Yeah, they've gotten... They got ghillie suits now. That'll save your life. I wonder if her tent broke like in the middle of the night, so they just included that into the story. <laughs> <laughs> like, we don't want to fix it, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna improvise this. I want to get a fucking shot of the ghillie suit guys, but I couldn't see him going. Did you break on? I won't turn on. I'm serious. Is your break on? Oh, hold on. Ah. Hey, stay in character. Stay in character. Oh my god! He just <laughs> Oh my god! I was not expecting that. Okay, this is new. this time? Yeah, but... <laughs> Robin, what happened? Robin, what happened? I'm just kidding. What is that big pain? Yeah, Robbie. 
you think we could fit in this parasol together? I mean, I think it would be a tight squeeze, but I think we could do it. It is? It's real for us. She looked out. This is a whole new scene that I didn't get to see at all. Mm. Prior to this, he just drove through it and went to the next scene. That's why you always go the second week. Oh, it shakes off! Oh, I missed that smell. Halloween Horror Nights, where you at? Okay, I'm gonna take down my nose just a bit because I gotta really smell that. Robin likes that smell too. Please, help me. please, please, somebody's gonna help me, please! Get in the Killer, execution. I think Joker every time I think of clowns. It's been in, embedded in your mind it has. as a DC for years. Yep. You think clowns, you're like, Joker would fit perfectly here. Joker could go here.
I'm just saying. <laughs> That's what happens when you play with stuff you're not supposed to be playing with. Yep. Oh, bloody Mary, you got it. You call me gelada, you have a good time. Yeah. <laughs> Me gelada guarantees you a good Mexican beer time. Yeah. Depends which one you want though. Do you want a Modelo, Corona? <laughs> Miss Mary, you have a good evening. Right, guys we just got done with my second time and Rob's first time at Urban Legends Haunt. Rob uh, being that your first time what did you think about it man? You know what I really enjoyed it man uh, just just the environment the different stories um, certain stories I liked a little more than others but I did enjoy all the stories that they had um, the the characters uh, were I didn't think they were gonna be as uh, interactive but they were um, and I enjoy that it just it it, it was overall I think it was a fun event I enjoy you know I enjoyed the whole thing um, the music uh, the storytelling uh, just each individual story I thought was a pretty good job definitely like I said this was my second time around and so I really thought they did a lot of nice changes and for the better honestly and you know so much changes like I said over on Rob's video we're gonna do an in-depth review about this pretty soon uh, about the first and second time that we went so you can learn more about it uh, what they've changed and how it's affected it going forward so urban legends like I said, you got our support here at the Knights of Horror and Howling Hour as well. Uh, we really appreciate you putting on a haunt at a very difficult time yes, this yes, year. Thank so you. thank you for keeping Halloween alive, Urban Legends. And if you guys enjoyed this video, hit that like button and that subscribe button if you're new. With that bell notification, be aware every time we put up a video. And follow us on all of our social media at Knights of Horror on Twitter and at the Knights of Horror on Instagram. I'm Anthony. And I'm Rob. And this is the Knights of Horror. We will see you guys next time.